Hi guys. We are in Highland of Scotland. Yeah. And we are on our way to the TVV locations. Yeah, we're going to see the uh, location of where they shot the movie Highlander, the castle. But we're also going to visit where they shot the scenes from Skyfall, where M uh, met a sad end. <laughs> uh, so as you can see, it's already looking a little bit uh, Skyfall country. Uh, and we'll show you a little bit more before we get there. It says we're on 12 minutes away to Skyfall. So this is a location of one of the Skyfall movie scenes uh, and just between the two mountains there Yeah, I think that where the truck is, I think they stopped there facing that way with yeah. the Aston Martin <laughs> yeah, there's a, yeah, there's a little bridge there But we can't stop there though They can't stop there and we can't afford an Aston Martin <laughs> I know, we've only so, got the Octavian <laughs> so, so, um, Unfortunately, our channel budget doesn't stretch to an Aston Martin, uh, but we can bring you to the beautiful uh, really locations. And this is at the foot of the Glencoe mountain range. Yeah. And I'll just flip the camera around in a minute and I'll show you the Glencoe mountains where they do the skiing. And you might just be able to see a little bit of snow up on top of the mountain range there although it is a little bit misty today the, mi the mist the mist yeah uh, we might have some video of that from when we came years ago with your mummy so if we if we have we'll put a this little bit of that in this is a clip from 2015 where joanne's mum was visiting us <laughs> and she'd never seen snow so we made a long trip to glencoe and this is her first time ever experiencing camera, snow. Is that camera? Yeah. <laughs> <They're all snowball. laughs> Good job. down the road uh, from the opposite direction of where uh, where the scene was shown we have to stop it's just stunning so you can see the uh, mist rolling in over the mountains there yeah it's absolutely and beautiful. we're now on the way to Aylan Donan Castle to see the location where the Scottish scenes of the 1980s movie Highlander was shot. So we've just arrived at Elan Donan Castle. Yeah. Uh, we've had a long drive but it was some beautiful, beautiful scenery through the highlands. Uh, some stunning mountains and uh, snow tops. Lock. Yeah, and, and yeah, beautiful locks. But this is a location, Elan Donan, that we've come to see. Where they shot the scenes, the opening scenes of Highlander, Elan Donan Castle. And I first watched the movie, I think, in about the year 1986 or something like that. And it's always been one of my favourite movies. Uh, but it's taken me way too long to come here. <laughs> I can imagine it's a long, long way, isn't but, it? 
but it's a very long drive to, to reach this place from where we live. Uh, but yeah, I'm really happy to be here today and to be able to show a little bit of it on the video with you. Let's yeah. go in. Yeah, let's go in the castle. This is one of the scenes from the amazing movie Highlander and if you've never seen the movie, I can highly recommend it. Aylandonan Castle was built in the 13th century and it was built to protect against raids from the Vikings. In the year 1719, the castle was involved in the Jacobite Rebellion and Spanish soldiers joined the Jacobites but the British government heard about the plot and sent warships and they fired cannons at the castle and eventually they overrun the castle and blew it up with captured dynamite. The castle was rebuilt in the 20th century by Lieutenant Colonel John McRae Gilstrap. That's surprisingly high actually, isn't it? Mm. A nice little courtyard here. There is lots of logs. An old castle door there. And this is the view. It's in the footwear and the courtyard. Yeah, in the courtyard of the castle, or just on the outside of the castle and this castle connects to three locks I believe. Absolutely gorgeous here, isn't it? Yeah and we've been lucky with the weather aren't we as well. Yeah, look at that. It's a little bit late in the day, but we've just got one more waterfall to show everybody. When we got back to our hotel, it had gone dark and we were lucky just to be able to catch a little bit of the Northern Lights, truly magical. 